Hi. Hi. Good morning. Well, good night for you, I think. You're probably sleeping still. And when you wake up, you will have this little surprise to greet you. Surprise. Uh, I know we said we wouldn't talk. I know I said I wouldn't talk to you ever, ever, ever again. And then I moved 3,000 miles away to just further underscore that point. But it felt kind of important today. It felt important to let you know I met someone more than met. I, um, I've gotten serious with someone. Gabe. That's his name. And it's none of your damn business. It's not. But I'm telling you anyway, because I, I wanted you to know that it feels right with Gabe. Just right in a way that I, I wasn't looking for it. Last week, I left for work without my umbrella, and when I arrived at home, it was just, it's just a total downpour, and I thought to myself, okay, well, I paid too much for this purse anyway, so serves me right, but then I looked up, and there was Gabe at the edge of the parking lot, just waiting with this, this massive umbrella, just waiting to keep me dry from the rain because why wouldn't he? He asked me to marry him. That's not why I'm hiding in the closet. I'm not hiding in the closet. I just came into the closet while he was getting dressed for work and then I stayed because, because none of your business. I haven't said yes yet. He got me a ring, unlike you with your drunken proposal that night under the Brooklyn Bridge. He got me a real ring and got down on one knee with a real proposal and I, I haven't said yes. It's a beautiful ring. It's a beautiful ring. I, that's not even the point. I mean, it could be ugly or tiny or ugly and tiny. And I'd, I'd still, I'd still be hiding in the closet talking to you. So, <clears throat> so here's the deal. You are not going to ruin this for me. I know that historically that, that over has never actually been over where we're involved. I know that there's always been some party or some bar or some stupid wedding of one of our stupid friends and there you are with your stupid face and your stupid speed stick smell and it starts all over I know you started to count on that I know you just don't don't call don't come out here. Don't make some grand gesture. Don't assume that I'm still here for you to pick back up again. Don't. Gabe says that he likes me in hats. Do you remember when I bought this one? You laughed when I brought it home and I felt like an idiot and I stuck it away in the back of the closet. Well, I got it out again after the move, and Gabe says he likes it. And, and, he says my painting is beautiful. He never calls it the, the freaky child ghost. He never speaks without thinking. He never makes me feel small, like... She is kind of a freaky child ghost, but I used to like her, and then you got in my head. I hope you find someone, too. I hope you find someone, and it's easier, and she laughs at your jokes even when she's mad. Even when you're fighting, and she never shouts. For Christ's sakes, is everything a joke to you? <laughs> 
or maybe you have already found her and that would that would be that would be have you it's none of my business obviously it's good if you have oh god you have you have and i'm an idiot i'm an idiot reaching out for closure and you're back there just fully closed serves me right well, that's good if that's the case. That's really, that's really what I wanted anyway for both of us. So here's, here's the deal. I'm not going to ruin this for you. I hope you know that. I'm not going to crash back into your life again or call when I'm missing you. Not that I've been missing you. I just mean, I'm standing here in your past wishing you well. Do you like how she looks in hats? I hope so. I hope she's better for you than I was. Gabe is better for me. That's what I wanted to tell you. I've built something really steady without all the back and forth. And we won't have four dramatic breakups. And I won't need 3,000 miles of distance just to get him out of my heart. I found everything I wanted. I have everything we couldn't be. <laughs> so here's the deal. Ruin this for me.